This is an Orion battery management system. When purchasing, we sell them as a kit of parts. So you get your Orion battery management system. These do vary, vary in sizes. We do a 36 uh, right up to the 108 on our website, but we can do large ones if required. We can also do master and slaves, so you could have um, two sizes for the satellite system, so front and rear battery box, you have 36 in the front, 72 in the back, etc. Uh, as part of the kit, you also get cell tap loom. Um, now, these all vary depending on the, the one you buy, um, but this is a 36 way. Um, but if you buy, say, a 48S, you'll get a 36 and the remainder on a smaller loom. Um, they come pre wired and pre numbered. Um, so you have minus one all the way up to 36. With that, you get a current sensor and cell temperature loom. Now these are pre wired with eight temperature sensors, but you can cut the temperature sensor off and hardwire them into your batteries, like on the Tesla units, Calb, LG units, etc. Um, now, depending on whether you order, depending on the size of current sensor you order will depend on what current sensors you get. So we go right now to 200 amp, right up to 2000 amp. But if you do 2000, you actually get two 1000 current sensors. If you're below 1000, you'll get a single current sensor. If you do get a dual current sensor system, you'll get an adapter, which basically splits this loom into two for two current sensors. In addition, you have the option of either an Orion IO loom which is a pre-wired multi-pin loom for the Orion with every single output, or you can go for the zero EV low voltage junction box, which quite simply takes this information from the Orion into a low voltage junction box and gives you a simpler set of outputs for things like chargers, DC to DC, etc., with fuses and relays built in. Now, something we use on a lot of our builds, but in most of the simpler builds out there, it's not something you're actually gonna require.